<laughs> thanks, thanks. The, 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 the truth of the matter is, I mean, I should not have been here. This should have been Sabrina's show because she, no does, it much, way. she, no. she does it much better than me. No, <laughs> I learned it from you. I honestly speaking, I'm a, I'm a sort of a, my name is Francis Percival. I'm a sort of a jack of all, master of none. Uh, I dabble around in a lot of, in a lot of stuff from, from, I mean, from sports to music to uh, craft. So I'm, I'm always on the, on the fringe of <laughs> going towards the top, but I'm always there. Yeah. But I also learned this, honestly speaking, I learned this only through YouTube, through no one else, through no this. So it is, I mean, if you go. Even no. if you go through YouTube, you will learn this. You don't need somebody to teach you this. It's a very, uh, decoupage is a very simple and uh, the best part of it is I always say to everybody, it's a very messy affair. So you like to get your hands dirty. You don't have to be, you know, perfect. It it can it can go this way, that way. It doesn't make a difference. Because at the end of the day, you can camouflage it with uh, with whatever accessories you have. That's why I had mentioned that you keep any, I, I collect a lot of uh, uh, kachara, as my wife calls it, uh, just pieces of... Uh, this is from your from your Christmas tree. You just keep it across. It always comes. It always comes in handy. You never know when it will come to you know just stick it on a bottle and it makes that bottle look all uh, that much better when you're doing a decoupage. You can also, I mean, uh, glitter glitter is a very big part of uh, of. One decoupage. minute, Francis. I mean, can you yeah. please put that mouthpiece a little higher? You're very okay. soft. Yeah. Okay. Is that good? Better. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Much yeah. So as I was saying, you just—I mean—you collect a lot of stuff at home, which you actually, in normal circumstances, you wouldn't require, uh, and you dump it in a box or somewhere which is convenient for you. And you can—you can—you never know when you may need it. I picked up this from a, 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 a stationery shop some days ago, oh. and it, it really came uh, in handy for some of my uh, bottle projects. I don't have that bottle now. Uh, basically, it's decorating a bottle and nowadays and nowadays it's not only bottle you can do it on uh, on wood on tiles on uh, you name it you can do decoupage i just saw a video actually of a lady who bought an old table i remember these tables we had in in goa these old wooden tables strong tables and she bought it at a thrift shop for 10 dollars or something like that in the us and she converted it into such a lovely decoupage although she used am i too fast for you no perfect <laughs> Perfect. My wife always says I'm very fast when I'm talking. <laughs> so uh, the, she converted this table. I will send you the link later. This table into a lovely project, and she put a decoupage paper on top. They have there's a different there's a different way of uh, doing decoupage with different surfaces. So uh, for the wood, you need to iron it out with a parchment paper on top. So it sticks well. You put Mod Podge glue or whatever glue you're using on top of the table and you put the decoupage paper, which is also a bit of a different paper. It's not a t regular tissue paper, but you get these, uh, you'll get it on Amazon or something like that. And she ironed it with parchment paper on top and then put a layer of uh, resin on top. And it looks so beautiful, that table. It was a $10 table. She's saying, if I had to sell it at the moment, I could sell it easily for $200. Wow. Which would be a still, which would still be a steal. She did it so well. I'll send you the link later on. So decoupage basically can be done on any surface. It's only the, it's only the material you use that changes a bit from here and there. So what we will be doing today is on a bottle. So if you'll have a bottle, any bottle would do. I prefer rounded surfaces. It, it, it makes that it uh, look much better. Uh, it gives you a better finish, or as opposed to as opposed to square bottles. That's a black label bottle. So as opposed to square bottles, uh, the uh, the the round bottles look a bit better. Uh, and just to show you a few samples, this was done in a hurry. This is this is another piece of uh, decoupage, which is called inverted decoupage. I mean, that's my name for it because you do it in the in the in the other way. I don't know if you can see. Is there a glare coming on it? Yeah. That Jesus and Mother Mary in the bottle, which is actually stuck behind the bottle. The picture. Okay. So those are some. This is another Christmassy one. Beautiful. Yeah. So this is what we are going to learn today. It's it's very very simple. You don't have to worry your head about it. It's plain basic uh, handwork. I don't know. I don't know what we call, <laughs> call it. The 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 truth of the matter is, after I did one course at uh, we we did one uh, event at uh, Circle of Grey. If you see Sabrina's work, you'll be 
even more surprised. Her work is absolutely brilliant. I've seen some of her stuff on cups and glasses and you name it. And uh, she, she was absolutely amazing. That's why I said I didn't need to be here because uh, Sabrina is a much better uh, artist than me. And more no, creative. No, not, not. And, and most of all, she's a better teacher. I'm, I'm absolutely useless at teaching. <laughs> I sort of, I mean, I was, I never liked teachers and I never <laughs> could be a teacher. Sorry for all the teachers around. I mean, <laughs> never liked in the sense, never liked in the sense, I was never a studious person. I was more of the, uh, there was more of a rebel in me, sort of. I was always, if you say, don't do this, I would uh, definitely do it. You know, that was that type of character. So anyway, so let's get on. I hope you'll have your material. Even if you don't have your material, you can just pay attention and, uh, uh, and do it uh, in your own uh, sweet time. You don't have to have all the materials as well. As I said, you can just pick up any 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 sort of material to use. I picked up these uh, colored um, uh, to the ice cream sticks and uh, a lot of this uh, tinsel, whatever we call it. Just keep it around. It always it always comes in handy. You never know when when we need it. Okay, so in case you are using a glass bottle or any any glass surface, always the the rule of thumb is always painted white first. So what we do is we normally paint, a, uh, give a good paint of uh, white over on the bottle, on the glass bottle, so that your 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 tissue or whatever you're using tissue paper stands out. Also, it gives a good uh, background uh, background base for your for your tissue. So have you all got your bottles? Yes. Just for those, I mean, yeah. So what we do is if you'll have your tissue papers now, tissues come in two types. They come in two ply and three ply. The most difficult job of this, it's not difficult, but the most uh, tedious job of this uh, decoupage is to remove the three plies. I mean, you remove the three plies. Well, what we'll do first is, if you'll have your tissue papers, can you can you all show me your tissue papers? If you'll have your tissue papers. Yeah. Yeah. So if you have your tissue so you papers your... and, and you, you know what design you want, if you know what design you want, for example, I want only these these leaves or, or the, just for the for, we'll just do the starting with just the leaves and this yeah i'll do this half these leaves and uh, and that maple leaf sort of so you just cut it out this is this is the best part of the job you don't need to use a scissors because if you use a scissors you're getting that sharp edge you don't want that sharp edge you want a rough edge so cut it out with your hand just with your hand take your i don't know if you can see the just take it and cut it along the edge of the design you want tear it yeah that's the whole fun of doing decoupage, actually. So you tear it along the design. There's also another way of doing this, but that is a more professional way, which I am not into. You, they have nowadays these water, 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 water pens. You dab along the border with a water pen, automatically it becomes soft and you just easily tear it. But you need to do a little bit of trouble. I mean, you want your work to be good, you need to take a little bit of trouble. So you just tear it along the border as close as possible to the design you want. Take your time. There's no hurry. I mean, again, you don't have to be perfect. Even if you cut, even if you tear across a piece that you wanted, but it it it'll still work. It'll still work. So don't uh, worry your head about that. You could also use the whole tissue for the whole bottle and just wrap it around. But that makes the that makes it so easy and that, that bottle looks a bit, uh, you know, just simple. I mean, it, it doesn't look nice, but it's just, just a basic uh, decoupage. In this case, you can put the designs as you want. Okay, have you all done that? I mean, you can take your time, no worries. Yes, yes. Almost finishing. But can I... Um... Color the bottle later. No, we will. We will do the. I, I'll tell you. Well, we'll do the bottle now. As soon as okay. we finish tearing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, you can basically use any type of paint. I use acrylic because if uh, uh, you can also put a, a lacquer on top after you finish to for the paper to hold and last for a long time. And we put a lacquer on top like a. I don't know. I, I don't know what glue you're using. I use Mod Podge. It's okay. easily available, and uh, there's a lacquer which is acrylic medium gloss. It's called this. If you want, I can just give it to you later on the 
where you get it from, etc. Or you could use even fevicol, but fevicol you would have to mix it two parts fevicol and one part water just to water it down a bit because fevicol is a bit thick. As even moch is there, but moch is good enough to use as on its own. Now we can go ahead and paint the bottle. I use a white acrylic. Okay. White acrylic. Once again, you don't have to be perfect in your paint. Now there are two ways of painting this. There are two ways of painting this. One is, it's a very peculiar way, but it's it, it makes it more outstanding. Is you use a piece of your... Yes. Scrubbing sponge. You know a scrubbing sponge? Yeah. Scotch bright or whatever. That you just cut a piece from, from your <laughs> washroom or uh, sink. A clean one, obviously. You use a piece of that. And you can use it on both sides. Now, what happens is, when you use it on the on the yellow side, it gives a nice, and you just dab it, uh, dab it in your paint. It gives a nice uh, spongy and uh, coarse effect. It gives a very nice effect when you use uh, this. But I'm using the paintbrush now. You have to remember when you're using the paintbrush, just try and paint it in one di one direction only. So you will get a si nice. Uh, sort of a similar uniform uh, pattern on your on your bottle. So just go ahead and paint your bottle however way you want it. And I'll show you the way you can use it for also the sponge. Now, if you're using even a tissue with a black background, you still have to paint the bottle white. It still gives that good effect. And uh, you can do the uh, the finishing touches after you the bottle dries up and you stick the tissue paper on it. As I said, you don't have to be perfect because most of this will be covered up with your tissue paper later on, depending on the design you're using. And I remember when we were kids, mom used to say, don't dirty your hands, your hands are getting messed up. This is the best time now. You can dirty your hands and do what? <laughs> There's no issue at all. And I like that part. Okay, I think that's about. One thing I forgot to mention is always have a, a glass of water handy around so you can and, and a cloth 
So you can dip your brush because if, if you're using the glue, especially the fevicol or whatever glue you're using whilst painting, you want to just soak in for a bit. You don't want the brush to get hard. So you have a glass of uh, uh, water handy around. So have you done with painting the bottle? Mine is done. Yeah, mine is done too. Sort of. So now we just wait for a few minutes. In the meantime, now we can have the... Lorraine, we can have the introduction se uh, introdu <laughs> section. So you just know who's okay. who. Okay. Our teacher wants you all to introduce yourself. Don't call so me teacher. I'm Francis. Can you all please? <laughs> Sorry? Don't call me teacher. You know I'm me, Francis. right? Okay, Pope yeah, Francis. I, I guess I do. Exactly. Okay, I see Jen also there. Auntie Jane all is there. That's, that nice. you know. That's what I said. No? You know everyone. No, no, no. There are a lot of people I don't know. Burley is there, but not there. Bali is there, but not there. Exactly. There are a lot of people like that, actually. I mean, the videos are off. Uh, okay, uh, we'll start. Ah, Bali is there. Bali. Hi, Bali. Yeah, Bali, Bali. Bolinda. I can't hear you, Bolinda. Your audio is off. Nice to have St. Francis with us. <laughs> <laughs> Walking Pope miracles. Pope 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 miracles. Working yeah. miracles and getting all the fingers into action <laughs> yeah, it's, it's good once in a way to to use your your fingers and your creative uh, I know. <laughs> inside you you know it's always good we have fantastic magicians with us so you'll see them finally at the end <laughs> yeah that's great that's great the, the the basic idea of this all is to do it with a smile i mean there's no point in you know grudgingly doing something which you don't like okay you francis like. you have another student at work this is lena Hi, Lena. Her <laughs> face does look familiar, actually. No. You are in Bombay or Goa? I I shuttle between he Bombay shuttles. and Goa. <laughs> Is it some shuttle yeah, yes. yeah, so suddenly tomorrow you may see me in Goa. There's no this about it. That's great. That's great. Yeah. yeah okay, Tamakol also comes in uh, use. I'll, I'll tell you about that later. This is fine. Okay. Ah, uh, sponge. Okay, this fine. This is Jesse. Hi, Jesse. Jesse. Say hi. Hi, she's I'm in Jessie. Canada. Okay, I'm from Canada. okay you're, all, you're in Canada at the moment. Yes, so I live here. Oh, where about? Mr. Saga. Mr. Saga. Oh, Mr. Saga. Oh, Mr. Saga is famous. We've <laughs> yeah. been there quite often, actually. Yeah, I got oh, yeah. a relation staying here all over the place. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, in yeah, Toronto, Halifax, Mr. Saga as well. Okay. Nova Scotia, uh, where all? Vancouver, they're all over the place. Wow. So we've been there, we've been there quite often. Yeah, yeah. We've been there quite we just came back actually a few months ago. Oh. Okay. Yeah, but we were most of the time in Halifax, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I haven't visited Halifax yet. <laughs> Lots of places to Hon visit. Honestly speaking, a lot of a lot of Canadians whom I know, they say we visited more places in Canada than they themselves have. Yeah, yeah, very true. <laughs> Yeah, we've been to Banff as well. Have you been to Banff? No, we were just oh, saying, gosh, it's, it's a must. It's on our to-do yeah. list. But we keep going to India every year. Most ah, oh, every He's time. waiting for me to go there and then go to Banff. Oh, that, that would be yeah. brilliant. That would be brilliant. Actually, yeah. it's, it's really a beautiful place. It's really a very serene yeah, place. Yeah, it's really place. beautiful. Yeah. That's yeah. what I yeah. mean. I went there with my nephew. In fact, he drove us all the way from Saskatchewan. Wow. Which was pretty decent. A pretty nice ride as well. The roads there obviously are much better than India, so we always find it better. <laughs> That's true. And then there's some, uh, there's Ligia. I see Ligia as well. Okay, I'm changing. Hi, Ligia. This is Ligia from Nuve and Bangalore. Oh, Nuve. Shuttles Not... between Nuve and Bangalore. Oh, very good, nice. <laughs> true. All my life, I mean, oh, it's the second part of my life I've lived in Bangalore. The first part was in Bob. <laughs> Very first was in Goa, so now I'm back at Goa. Ah, uh, very and, good. Nuwe is not very not Nuwe is not very far from us. We are from Kolwa actually. Okay, yes, uh, it's not far. We go often to Kolwa. There's a nice cafe over there called uh, More Petit. Yes. Oh, More Petit, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, you must not very go to come to Kolwa. Really good. Yes. My sister is still in Kolwa at the moment, actually. Okay. Okay. So today I'm not doing the decoupage with you, but I'm just observing what you're doing. That's fine. That's fine. That's totally fine. I mean, it's as I said, it's 
this is not rocket science it's it's simple it's very simple and easy to do you don't need yeah. to i mean actually rack your gray cells it's, it's it's pretty easy it's pretty messy and it's 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 more of fun and at the end of the day your product looks good that's all that matters yes. the first time i actually did deco pa i think it was the first time i did it for my my whole family members i made them christmas bottles oops uh, i i initially thought it would be easy after after that i realized my wife has seven sisters and then it um, it <laughs> <laughs> my whole yeah. month i went i used to get up in the night and tearing paper you know thinking i'm still doing the decor part <laughs> yeah that's but yeah that that was that was fun that was fun but i mean see what happens is these are things which nowadays it's very difficult to think of what to give as gifts especially for christmas new year and anniversary these 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 things come in handy and people really appreciate it i mean nowadays people don't appreciate you giving them a shirt or a dress i mean everybody yeah. almost has it all and and what happens is especially i find it very this because buying a shirt for my friend i don't know if he'll like it or no because my choice is different his choice is different so he may not like the shirt i will buy for him and the end of the day it'll just lie in his cupboard uh, <laughs> not being used certainly uh-huh. these, these bottles these gifts they come in handy they keep in the showcase and every time somebody comes you can say oh this francis made or this sabrina made and this he gifted oh, us for christmas which is which is pretty appreciated appreciated by not only those people but by everybody else around yeah <laughs> and it gives I, a glow to the house yes it gives a give it gives a good to this to the house yeah yeah as well especially during christmas time and uh, i don't know if uh, we to you can put you can add these lights as well these are all accessories you don't need to buy them these are all accessories you can add the lights to the bottle you just put them inside the bottle and it just gives a, yeah. a effect it, especially during christmas time so i guess i think the bottle should be dried up by now if not we can wait a bit longer is goret i can see goretti there as well i not met goretti uh, the the trouble is i don't have white paint with me oh that's fine that's fine as as i said you don't need to do it uh, exactly today you can uh, just uh, you can do it i mean if you do it without the paint what will happen yeah. is it'll, the 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 this of the it will go through and through you'll see a light coming between the paper and this you'll not get a good effect of the of the tissue paper since your tissue paper is more of white it will you not get a good effect if the base is not white okay. so that's why the basic uh, the basic idea of putting uh, i mean painting the bottle white is to get a good effect because you know you're you're tearing that uh, i'll show you that now in a few minutes you're tearing the tissue into i mean not tearing your you're dividing the three plies oh. to make the tissue paper very thin so when it's very thin and you apply wet glue to oh. it it becomes very really transparent so when it becomes transparent you will get the glass bottle effect more than the than the tissue paper effect if you're not using white paint that is the whole reason they put a white paint to it but you can still try it because you're not wasting much i mean the, you can try it and see how it looks on the plain bottle and then you'll understand mm-hmm. this behind the the, the if, you, can, you can do it again uh, with the other bottle just try once on this bottle itself see this francis is telling all of us <laughs> I I don't have a white paint. I thought I had because I had so much of paint, but then I see that I must have used the white paint before. So I'm going to use a tissue which is the similar color, and okay. I painted it mauve. Oh, very good. Now, that's okay as long as the tissue has a bit of a background. It does have background. A, a background, like a little that tinge. You can um, also use. So I, oh, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. You just. try it out but what okay, happened is sorry hi hi neri neri did you say this is mary mary yeah okay mary hi hi mary how are you doing i'm doing fine my bottle is all painted and ready you must have seen it i don't know can you see it uh i can just see the neck actually ah uh, yeah now i can see it mm. that looks like a nice that looks like it was a nice wine bottle yes <laughs> Yeah. 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 Yeah, circle of grey. How are you? Circle. Of, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Absolutely good. Thanks. Thanks for showing us this uh, <laughs> talk again. Yeah, as But I said, this is not a. It's not. I, a, yeah. Sorry. I sorry. Have, I don't have the decoupage. Uh, 
tissue but can we use a simple tissue Yes, you can. It's very fine. I, I was going to tell you that it's very fine oh, if you use simple tissue. The the okay. now I'll just I mean just since you asked the question, I'll tell you. I told you that it has three plies. So what yeah. you have to do is try and remove the the ply from the tissue. Yeah. You divide the tissue. You you'll it it is a bit difficult, but mm -hmm. when you get down to it, when you open one corner, it will be open easily. So some tissues have two plies, and some people uh, some tissues have three plies plies. So if it's two ply also, yeah, even then you remove the paper because then it gives you the effect. You can if it's if it's too difficult, you can still use it, but you'll get a thick embossed effect on the tissue, which is still fine. Oh, my is there a uh, Francis, are you going yes. on with the introduction of this stuff? For the yeah, you have, you have. Uh, yeah, you can go until the bottles dry up, and everybody has their. Marian, I want to ask something. Please. I thought you have Francis. Sure. Yes, yeah. please. Hi, Francis. I know you. We met. Uh, one minute. I can't see who's talking. Huh? <laughs> ah, Ida. <laughs> see, Francis, I got this paper. You know. The, uh... Is that tissue paper, but it looks too stiff for tissue paper? It's not tissue, it's decoupage paper. Oh, is it? Oh, okay, that's fine. Yeah, like this. See, there, there, is, there are, there are, there's a variety of decoupage papers. Like, this is more the, these are more the professional type. They are very fine. You don't need to tear, you don't need to tear them. I mean, you don't need to split them apart. Yeah. This is and they have some beautiful like a, designs. This is like a... You know uh, how we would get a uh, wrapping paper like that. Yeah, yeah, but that would that would probably be a bit thick. So mm. what would happen is when you paint it, if you, if, if you're thinking of putting lights inside, the lights will not shine through. Mm. If you're thinking, but you can still do no. Nonetheless, you can use actually mm. basically. Yeah, actually, I don't is, think, is is I very have a is bottle, very. But I don't have a white paint, so I'm not painting. Okay, I mean, as I said, you can go ahead with whatever you have. There's no hard and fast rule. Uh, anyway, I will try with this. Let's see how it comes. Yeah, yeah. Let, let, you can always try. There's no harm in trying. Mm. Okay. Yeah, Lorraine, anybody else? Okay. One minute. There are a lot of them. Oh, lot I thought, I thought of we were only six or seven of us. Oh, is it? I thought we were only six or seven of us. No. <laughs> you know, we, currently we are 32. Oh, right is it? Now 31. So you have a quite many. Okay, this is Sheena from Bombay. Yes. Hi, hi, Sheena. Hi, Sheena. Hi, hi, Francis. I can't see you, but uh, yeah, I'm just going to talk. I can't okay. see you on this with my screen. Anyways, mm -hmm. I'm okay, from okay. Bombay, and I do come down to Goa and live in Kolba whenever oh, we come down. Yeah. Goa, where are neighbors? By the way, he's on the opposite road. You're on this road. So. <laughs> yeah. Where? Where about <laughs> Kolba? I'm. It's called Fatona. I don't even know about it. It's second word. Dusri word. Dusri word. Okay, okay. We are near the Florida Gardens. Akar Excelsior. That's where I live. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, I, I passed Akar. that place. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Sure, sure. That's where we, we live. <laughs> yeah, I shuttle. I mean, we shuttle. Now I'm in Bombay at the moment. True. But, same here. Uh, it gets a bit um, it gets a bit loud and noisy in Bombay. I ran away to Goa. True, it gets a bit definitely. Too... <laughs> terrible, terrible. It gets a bit Bombay too terrible. quiet in Goa. I come back to Bombay for some of the noise. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I have got my bottle, but I have uh, white paint is dry. So well, I I'll what do what it. white paint is that? You can you can add a bit of water to it, and there's no issue. No, no, I, I didn't realize it's almost over. <laughs> ah, okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine. Yeah. Once again, it's fine. You can once again, if you're just trying it out, mm -hmm. and you have bottles to spare, you can try it on on the plain bottle. Sure. It may not give you the same effect. But what you could do is because you know what will happen is even when you paint the bottle after after putting the uh, uh, after putting the uh, tissue on your bottle, mm -hmm. you'll get a you'll get a see through mm -hmm. effect from the bottle to the this and you'll get the outside okay, paint. Okay. You'll get the outside paint. You know. Polished. So now this is with the white background, so you can't see. Background, you put, correct. Yeah. If you put a, just the tissue paper on plain glass, you'll get a see through effect. So you'll not get that the I effect know. of I the know. tissue. Yeah, you know. What I'm I got it. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. Anyway, nice. But still, you can you. try. Nice, nice. Yeah, can, I'll you do can that. Still try it. Yeah, you can still try it. Yeah, I'll do that. And yeah, there's Marie, you. Marie Dell as well. I can see. <laughs> yes, that's me. Hi. Hi, hi, Marie. I live in Margao. 
Oh, cool. Not not very far. Yeah. Actually, so we are all very close by. Besides, uh, somebody was in Canada. Uh, Jesse. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Jesse in Canada, me in Portugal. Oh, you we know about. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is Jenny. Jen Rock, uh, we meet her. Yeah, I know very well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jen Rock, we met a lot. We partied a lot. <laughs> right. In fact, today is a busy day because uh, Mama Mary's statue is going around. So I apologize if I have to leave early, but. Uh, Oh, no, I will follow no, the instructions and then do it another day. So thank no, you for no, your I think uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. no worries. Sabrina is recording this. I think I'm not mistaken. Okay, great. Yes. Uh, yesterday, yesterday we had Ma uh, Mother Mary coming to our house in Kolwa as well. So I presume they're okay. taking it away, uh, taking away today. Mm -hmm. yeah. No worries, Jen. Yeah. Okay. We'll see you around. Yeah. Yeah. See okay. You. So thank we'll you go ahead with this. Much. Yeah. No worries. We'll go ahead with this. In the meantime, then when we stick it and then we can have the rest of the introductions. Uh, are we good, everybody? Has they have they torn their tissues? Yeah, we are always good, not naughty like you. <laughs> I I I was never a good. I mean, not good as in uh, good, but I was always naughty. Uh, my sister Merle will bears testament to that. <laughs> but I I I mean I so for some reason I don't like. Kids who are not naughty. If you're not naughty, it's not uh, it's not uh, normal for me. <laughs> I don't know why. So whenever I go to my my nephew's kids' house now, they are grand nephews and nieces. I play with them a lot. And some of the mothers, oh, be careful! His hand will come out. His leg. <laughs> I'm so rough and playful to them. I don't blame the mothers, obviously. I mean, you know. Come on. Anyway, so. Okay, so have we done with the uh, this? We can use the glue. Are you all ready with the glue? Do you all have Mod Podge, Fevicol? What is it? Fevicol. Uh, Fevicol. If you, remember, we're using Fevicol. Just try and mix. Take a small plastic glass and try and mix uh, two is to one or one is to one is also fine, but try and mix two is to one because Fevicol is a bit thick and it takes uh, a little longer. I use a Mod Podge. I have I use Fevicol as well sometimes because I, I mean I I dabble in other craft as well. So it's always handy, but uh, for for decoupage, I normally use a Mod Podge, which is very easily available everywhere in India as well. Two is to one is one of water and two of fevicol, or yes, 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 yes. Sorry, two is to uh, two is one uh, one of water and two fevicol. Thank you. Uh, Francis, if you don't mind, can you lower the laptop screen so that oh, they sorry, can see? Oh, sorry, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm just mixing the glue. Yeah, fine. Now, if you're using, I'm I'm using a smaller, smaller piece of uh, tissue. But if you're using a big piece of tissue, it's it's always better. It's always better. And before I say that, don't put the glue on the tissue. Please, don't put the glue on the tissue. Put the glue on the bottle. Always when you're sticking... Uh, tissue paper, uh, stick the glue on the bottle, put the glue, apply the glue on the bottle, not on the tissue. Okay. Now we're using a big, we're using a bigger uh, tissue. If you're wrapping it around all the bottle, a bigger, a bigger uh, piece you have cut off, try and put the middle, middle of the paper before putting the glue on your bottle. Sorry, <laughs> middle of the paper before putting it, try and find out the center and then apply to the center portion of the bottle. The glue, just a, just one layer, and again, when you're using this layer, again try and use it in one one stroke. Yeah. Just apply it. I mean, I'll use it this side. Just apply one stroke and put it where you expect the center of the tissue to be. That's it. Don't apply. Don't apply too much glue. If your glue is too watery, don't worry, but don't apply too much of it because then the tissue starts to sort of split up, tear. So try to use less glue as possible. Then you take your center, I don't know if I can see, and just place it on the bottle where you want it. Now, what you can do is also if you're getting if you're getting uh, uh, wrinkles, normally in tissue paper you do get wrinkles if the if your glue is too watery. 
if not it's fine or you can use the same sponge you can use the same sponge the other side to just press it down so it sticks firmly to the bottle now once you've done the center you can go ahead and apply to uh, the glue to the other side just shift the tissue a bit Now you know exactly where you want the glue to be. The trick here is to apply the, I mean, stick the tissue paper pretty gently because it the tissue, you know, it, uh, you are using only a single ply. So it tends to sort of tear. But even if it tears, don't worry, it doesn't make a difference. And on the edges, you can apply a coat of glue as well, so it sticks well. I know it's a bit messy, but that's the fun part. Try and get the edges well glued. <laughs> if you're getting wrinkles, it means the glue is either too watery or but it doesn't it, it it won't affect it much you can also use a, a normal you know the spray bottles these hairdressers use normal spray bottles you spray plants on just put water to it and add just spray it a bit a bit spray the this where the where the creases are and then automatically those creases will disappear because the tissue expands and then contracts into the perfect uh, try and iron out all the creases if possible. Did you buy me sausages? Uh -huh. I'm coming home. <laughs> what? So now I got this also in my pack of tissue papers which is very uh, which is very convenient because if you have uh, since i'm using a sort of a natural nature look if you have any odds and ends which you want to cover up you just cut out one of these these grass effects or a butterfly and stick it on top of the place you want to cover up so you know it uh, it hides any any imperfections so now if i got this edge here which I didn't uh, tear off. I can just put a piece of, you know, grass growing up or something so it hides the the. Are you guys done? Yeah. Not fully. No, no hurries, no hurries. And the advanced class will be held by Sabrina later on. No advanced. Oh my God. <laughs>
I need advanced class from you. <laughs> One is calling me. How you like? You get anything on the switches? No, God, no. I can do the same on purge with candle as well. Candle? On, on a what? candle? On a candle? Yeah. On wax, I'm not too sure. You'll have to check. With, I mean, I'll have to check whether the glue will stick. But it's pretty, uh, you know, it's pretty smooth, the candle. Yeah. Whether the glue will stick on that or no, I'm not too sure. I've not even tried. Okay, I've tried me... on wood. I've tried on wood and it gives a good effect on wood. Yes, it gives a very good effect from wood. Let me try candle and then I'll see. Probably what about use... metal? Metal, yes, it works on metal as well. Okay. I seen, I seen. So I've not tried, but I seen some videos of these uh, sort of money boxes and all. No, they've done it on metal. Metal, wood, even plastic. But plastic also is a bit difficult, I guess. I've not tried again on plastic because it's a very smooth and uh, I mean the glue is very difficult for plastic to stick. So I'm guess guessing if maybe you need to use a different type of glue. Because I'm sure fevicol and or a thicker consistency. Because I'm sure water down glue won't work. Can the tissues be overlapping? Yes, yes, it's fine. Just see how it it looks on your design. As long as it looks good on your design, it doesn't matter what you do, where you put it. Okay. Yeah, it's a nice bottle. Till now, we have not gone there. How you like it? Have you ever been? Uh, no. It's all. It all depends on your imagination. How you want it to look. You don't have to actually follow what I am doing. Please focus on your work, no, Francis. I'm focusing on my work only. <laughs> no. Teacher <laughs> Lorraine. <laughs> Oh, uh, okay, I just want to ask this. Well, I didn't buy the acrylic paint, yes. but they gave me some glass color, water based paint. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Totally fine. You're not, what? see, at the end of the day, you're not even, you can uh, use watercolor. Only thing you'll have to use it a bit thick, but you have to remember that you cannot, I mean, uh, keep it near moisture, or whatever, because then it will start. Okay. Sort of, yeah. But otherwise, you can use any, any sort of, any sort of medium. Yeah, but then it doesn't have a white color in it. It's a oh, torch it? and place the color and go. Yeah, on. it doesn't have a white color it's coming from it. Doesn't have a white color? That's uh, surprising. Okay. If it's a it's a it's a set of colors, white would obviously be there. No, there's no white. There is oh, some a... that you just put the torch in your then blue and lemon yellow, chocolate brown. Okay, you can you can use whatever base you want depending on the your background of your tissue. Like as uh, Sabrina said, she's using a mauve, a mauve uh, uh, tissue. So you could use whatever colors, I mean. Okay. But what, what I normally do is, even if I'm using a different color background, yeah. I first paint my base white. And when the, yeah. when the tissue dries up, then I use the, the sponge dab to dab into that particular color and dab it around the edges of that. So it gives that better effect. But you can still yeah. use, yeah, yeah. But you can still, but basically you need a base for the bottle. Okay, got it. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, and the very basic question I want to ask no is the, uh, the, the labels on the glass, do huh? they go simply by just water? What happened? Oh, the, oh, the, the, I didn't get that. The labels on the, on the bottles you're talking about? Yes, on the bottles. Yeah. So what I normally do is I soak them one day before. Okay. I soak, I soak them in a tub uh, in a basin one day before with warm water, and then they peel off easily. Unless there are some stick, some bottles have stickers, etc. Uh, yeah. Yeah, like uh, like this bottle, it has a it has these stickers. You can just remove them off. But these paper paper, this come out easily if you soak them in water. They just glue basically. So the glue yeah. gets it comes out. You put warm water, it's better. And okay. there are some bottles. I don't know how many of you are using those bottles. There are some bottles with a. Nowadays they come with a sort of a. Uh, plastic. Uh, this I don't know if any of you have found yeah. those bottles. So this, I mean, it's a bit difficult to remove. If you're intending to put lights, otherwise you can keep it like that. 
but if you're intending to put lights inside then you need to heat it this bottle so hot you heat it around this this portion uh, this portion you heat it around this portion this tears off with a scissors or any any pointed object you, it, once it melts you tear it off and this white thing then comes out this white thing oh. down then you have a normal bottle i had done it for a couple of bottles Francis, another easy way is to take the screwdriver and just dab it on the top that whole thing comes off is it yeah. i don't know i tried heating yeah. it i prefer heating it so it's easy can't take out no which has those what are they yes yeah. like this bottle i removed out and and you know what? even this even this is very what? interesting when you remove the top white plastic out it looks like this unbelievable yeah and unbelievably inside that you know to let the liquid alcohol flow through two marbles you get some marbles yeah <laughs> i don't know you can see them yeah they're small marbles which are which can be used again for in some way you know i'll use them as buttons or something you know eyes or whatever you can use them to improve your bottle so every every small thing that you this can be used you know so i i always these, these are the amount of bottles i made so far see how many caps and bottles all those parts i i can do those also so it comes sometimes it comes in use you never know i'm sort of a i'm sort of a scrap collector <laughs> For that you need a room. Otherwise, you're going to have scrap all over the place. Oh, you... <laughs> tell, tell me about if I have guests coming home. It takes me one day to clean up the hall. <laughs> <laughs> you need an extra room. Yeah. Yeah, in, 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 in Bombay, that would be a luxury. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> in Goa, it's possible. Okay, so now uh, I don't know if you'll have uh, done it. It's sort of dried up. We'll, in, in the meantime, we'll go. Any more? Any more people we have not met? There's Morris. Morris. Not spoken to. Hi, okay. Morris. <laughs> this is Victi uh, Victoria Delima. Hi, Hi. Victoria. Hi. I see you're, you're busy. I hope you're enjoying yourself. Oh yeah, I'm not actually an arty person. No, but that's I'm fine. Enjoying it, using my fingers it. more than anything. <laughs> that's the best. That, that's the whole fun of it. Yeah. That's the whole fun of it. You, you know, I'm a very sort of funny type yeah. of person. I can't yeah. eat. I or being yeah. a true goan, I still can't eat my. I can't eat rice and curry with my hands. Oh, but okay. Down to this stuff, I don't mind being messy. <laughs> anyway, I'll be running away for our ladies, the litany in somebody's house. Ah, no worries, no worries at all. Oh. No worries at all. You can see the I've seen of it is lovely. You, this is the basic. Actually, what yeah. we've done is now is just the basic. You can uh, use your imagination, do what you want. I mean, that's what I was going to say. Once we complete this, I'll leave it up to you all to decorate, and we'll see in the next. Uh, not class, but the next one day we can just have an exhibition of all the bottles. Yeah, lovely. Who has done what? So yeah, so no problem. You can yeah. Oh, Barbara is there as well. So, so when you put the acrylic paint and yeah. keep it for, uh, is it okay to keep it for drying for several days and then work on it again? No, no, no. We just painted and we already started working on it. The base. So you're supposing talking, you. The, you're talking about the base, the right? Yeah, if the base is put, then it has to dry, right? Yeah, it, it dries quite easily. Acrylic quite dries quite easily. In fact, as I said, we just painted this bottle. It's already dried. And no, I so my... take several bottles and I uh, paint them and okay. I keep them for saying that, okay, I'll do it tomorrow. I'll put That's fine. That's uh, fine. There's nothing going to go wrong with the bottle. I... Yeah, yeah. Nothing. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. That's perfectly okay. fine. Hmm. Okay, Francis, this is Adeline, yeah. the one that the mystery Adeline. Hi, hi, Adeline. Hi, hey, Adeline. It's Adeline, hey, Sabrina's sister and brother in law. Oh, is it? Sabrina's sister, but I'm not as creative as she is. Of course, you are. <laughs> so, uh, how, how many sisters are you all, Sabrina? Three sisters. Yeah, because uh, Hazel at a sh this was uh, a diamond that another sister of you all attend of yours attended the party. I said I'm sure I would have, I would have known if Sabrina's sister had attended. This that this party. lady, this lady. But, it, but the topic attend. was about this lady. Adeline. Which party? Which party? On the fifth, sixteenth of August at Goa. But you were definitely not there. No, she was not. No, 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 no,
Adeline. Adeline, yeah, she said Adeline, correct. Yeah, she said Adeline. Now you remember. Oh. When is this in Benauli? No. Oh, no, this was at uh, Terry's in Panjim. No, Bethi. she was not uh, there. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know she was not there. I notice all women. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> so Francis mystery solved, okay? I know, yeah, solved, solved. But I, I was, okay, I was this. Move way. on to Mars. Yeah, you have still more ladies. If you, oh, lovely. You will want to meet everyone. That's the okay, that's the this best is part Marcia. of that's the best part of doing this such workshops. There are more women than men around. <laughs> hi, Marcia. Hi, hi. Hey, you're looking pretty busy. That's good. <laughs> Yo, okay, this, this, I'm replacing this Yvette. Day. This is Yvette. Oh, hi, Yvette. Hi, Yvette. Hi. Okay, Yvette also is very busy. Yvette also from Goa? Yes. Yes, Goa. Ah, cool. Okay, Avita is not on a seat right now. Avita, are you there? Yeah, yeah, I'm there. I'm there. You have to put okay. a, this a little low, I think. Yeah. The, camera. Can't see. <laughs> the camera needs to go low, yeah. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. You're sure you can see what you're doing? Sorry? You're sure you can see what you're doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, <laughs> I'm not doing. Nuts. I'm just following. I'm just following ah, cool. you all. Oh, no worries. No worries. No worries at all. No yeah. worries at all. Oh. I'm just okay. following. I replaced to Ida. Ida, yeah. we have met. We've met, we've met Ida a lot. Okay, Barbara. <laughs> yeah, Ida, you have some questions? Yeah. Hi. No, I'm, I'm just uh, looking at you all because I cannot do anything because my I don't have white white paint. Ah, okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I just put ah, you need to room. Ah, okay, that's fine. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. But what you do is now, later on you uh, dab, take the sponge when you get the white paint and dab it around the border. Okay. With no, the I'm with just, the sort I'm of yeah. Try and blend it with the with your border. <laughs> Painting of bottles. Okay, Francis, this is B Barbara. Hi, Barbara. <laughs> I know Barbara. Hi, hi. We yeah, meet, hi. We meet once Barbara. again. I don't know if you can hear me. Hi. Yeah, I can. I can. Loud and clear. <laughs> okay. My throat is bad. That's why. <laughs> oh, tell me about it. Yeah. It's going around. Okay, this is Fatima. Uh, this one, this lady also you met. Yeah. Did I? Yeah. Yes, you did. Okay, uh, the rest, Hi, can you please, Eunice, Veridian, you have met. Eunice, can you please put on your camera? There's there's no uh, compulsion. I just, I just want to know who, who we are working with. I mean, uh, uh, okay, God, Liva, Jane, no, there's no Jennifer, compulsion. Elisa. There's no compulsion. Yeah, my don't want my to video is not coming on. So uh, I don't know why. Oh, oh that's fine. That's fine. Hello, hello Francis. Hi. hi. Um, hope by the end of this session, you will like teachers because you are going to be one of them. <laughs> <laughs> you already are, actually. <laughs> <laughs> May I add, Francis, that Eunice, you, you spoke to Eunice, you spoke to Fatima, Fatima. All these are great artists. Oh, Very cool. talented. Then I... So I have to Two be in the talented individuals yeah, that you met. Yeah. Eunice is multi talented, <laughs> and so is Fatima. Oh, and cool. so are all magicians. We all like naughty teachers. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's the best part. I mean, I I wouldn't classify myself as a teacher, but uh, the naughtiness, yes. Uh, all of us are. In, uh, I mean, teachers in some <laughs> form or the other. So, yeah. you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. And we love yeah, exactly. naughty children. <laughs> 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 well, the, the, the funny part was, although I used to get a lot of uh, shouting at, and at times caning as well in school, once I met my teachers for a school reunion, they were so happy to meet me. They said, oh, I remember. They, it's, it's, the good part is they remember such children, you know. So they remembered me. <laughs> because they yes. always I don't know in Bombay, who, how many of you all studied in Bombay, but in Bombay, we were a class of 90. So it's a difficult, it's oh. difficult to remember everybody. But they remember the standout children. And one I was one of the standout, oh. not for not for being studious, for other reasons, obviously. <laughs> the standout and no, outstanding. Standout. <laughs> so I was happy in that respect. At least my teachers remembered me. <laughs> of course. Of course. 
fun, yeah. the fun boy. The naughty <laughs> children are always the standouts. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Somehow we love them the most. <laughs> They're the most affectionate. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> that my that 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 my wife That's has how... to uh, agree to. The outstanding. <laughs> The That's how they still life. remain <laughs> the, our best friends till today. <laughs> yeah, so I guess uh, most of you all must have dried up by now, everybody. Yes. So if you ready. see the, the white, you can hardly notice the white uh, cutout of the this. You can only see the green leaf. True. The white Very cutout is, is blends with the with mm. the white background. That is the reason for the white background. Now, if you're if you're if you see yeah, the leaf and you want to blend it further, you can use a, a different color or a, I mean, whatever you want to sort of accessorize. So let's see, let's see everybody's bottle so far, if at all we can. Who has done it? Francis. <laughs> Francis, mine wasn't good at all to put a, uh, the that color paint because okay. yeah, this is Ida. Francis, we do it. I, yeah, yeah. I have to complete it. I just put. No it. worries. We just want to see the incomplete. You want to see the incomplete, <laughs> so that we can just you know, we can uh, brainstorm and get some ideas of how to. This that's good. That's good. What you uh, again see if you can see. You can mm. see through the car. I mean, because there's no white uh, background. Mm. But otherwise, you can now. What you can do is, I mean, you can when you get the white paint, dab it around, around the edges. Because see, what happens is, as you can see, you cannot. See, uh, if you see my bottle, you cannot see the edges mm. of the. You can only see the leaf. Yeah, so it looks yeah. like part mm. of the bottle. But as uh, for yours, you can see the edges which you yeah. need to camouflage. Mm -hmm. So use your creativity, use your imagination, and try and camouflage the edges so it it blends with the bottle. Yes. If you blend it, it should blend with the bottle. Anybody else? Anybody else? Yeah, half done. Yeah, it's all half done. Even ours is half done. No worries. Redo mine, Francis. No worries. But I started the candle. I started ah, the candle. That, oh, started the candle. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. nice. But what what glue did you use? I use the same glue. Oh, same glue. Hot podge. Yeah. And uh, I'm going to redo this. I'm going to take it out and redo yeah. it. I'll post the, the I'll finished post product. the finished product, okay? But no I'm yeah. happy with the candle because it's drying up well. Yeah, it will. I would, but I'm only, I was only worried about it sticking to the. I mean, the glue sticking, holding. It it is. It is holding. Yeah, very good. Very good. Uh, Belinda, Belinda, can we see yours, Belinda? Uh, uh, yeah. Can you see mine? Can you see mine? Oh, oh Belinda. Where's that? I, I will uh, showing. I cannot Where? see. I mean. oh. Ah, this wow. is yeah. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Beautiful, that's nice. Adeline. Yeah, Adeline. Uh, just a suggestion. Could you just uh stick up more? Oh, is that the jutting? Oh no, that's a part of the bottle. Oh no, yeah. Could you just no, do no. the edges? Just to just to do a finish finishing. Could you do the edges with a bit more glue? Apply the other side. The other side. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The other side. Yeah, yeah. The other yeah. side. Yes. Yeah, yeah. This oh, side. Yeah. Could you just apply more glue to the edges to just give it a nice okay. smooth finish? But it looks wow. beautiful. It looks beautiful. Yeah, it looks beautiful. Very beautiful, Adeline. See, this is what the effect of the white does. The background white. Yes, this is what it yes, gives a good standout yes. effect. Ice cream, Adi. You get the paper. Very beautiful as well. Yeah, yeah you get you these. Uh, I can again send you all the link on Amazon. It's easily available. You put decoupage napkins on Amazon, de uh, decoupage papers on Amazon. They're pretty reasonable price uh, uh, as opposed to buying it from outside. <laughs> but yeah, so you get you get it in Amazon. You get most of these products on Amazon. Yeah, yeah. It's, Lorraine, oh, that's nice. Oh, that's a beautiful, uh, a beautiful team. That's lovely. But uh, the mermaid got all creases all over. Oh, creases. So I'll I'll give you an idea. Uh, yeah. Let it dry up a bit. Then okay. take this water spray. You know, they have the water spray which you use to spray plants. Yeah. The smaller yeah. one. Yeah. Just put yeah. a little water in and just spray it a bit. Light spray. Light okay. spray. Then the okay. creases sort of vanish. You okay. use a full of uh, full of uh, pepper. You didn't cut it. I cut and I pasted patches here and there. Very good. It, look, no, it looks, it looks yeah. brilliant. It looks brilliant. Small, small pieces. What? Wherever I can see white, I just put the patches here it and there. Lovely. It looks lovely. It looks lovely. If you can, if you can get uh, some it. pictures with fish or something and put it around the place. I mean, do your own imagination. Yeah, yeah. Your own imagination yeah, there, to... um, yeah I should have. Oh, there is a fish there. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. Behind. Nemo, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. I should have put it here. Yeah. Very. Yeah. 
Great, great. You dried up and look even better. I just wanted to try. I think my glue yeah. was a little bit thin. That's oh, why. Oh, that's what. Yeah, that's why. That's what I said initially. Don't make it too yes. watery because then you get the creases. Yeah, it was yeah, little. Yeah. That's why it didn't get stuck. Properly. No worries. No worries. Yeah. But what Thank happens, you. you know, in 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 yeah. uh, in the coupage, if you keep the bottle out uh, outside, I mean, for display, you cannot see the creases unless you go close by to it. Yes. Another another <laughs> another another trick or not a trick. I, I what normally people do is use this lacquer. You can get the lacquer. I don't know if you can see it. The lacquer you get, you apply it. Mm. It'll it'll automatically remove the creases. It does that also. It gives a good shine and a finish to this. And the third thing, it protects it protects the your work. You know, you can keep it for a longer time. What happens is, if you don't use this lacquer, if you're keeping the bottle at home, dust collects and then it, it loses its its shine and its uh, sort of this. This lacquer mm. protects the bottle. Thank you. May I ask you a related question? Yeah, please. Yeah, you know what? Uh, I've done some painting on acrylic, and I find this, in the monsoon. Uh, who, who? This is Yvette. Yvette. Ah, Yvette. Yvette. Yeah. Thank you. I've done some painting on acrylic, okay. and I find it collected fungus in the monsoon. Can I spray lac on it, or is it going to be messy? Uh, you are using acrylic paints, right? Acrylic on canvas. On canvas. Oh, on canvas. I have not tried, but it should be okay. But I don't huh? know. If lacquer, I I am not too sure of the reaction of lacquer on. I know reaction of lacquer on acrylic will not affect, but I am not sure of the reaction of. Lacquer on the, the canvas because you know what happened. The you don't want the paint to bleed into the canvas. Correct, um, correct. That's the only issue we have. So I don't know about. I cannot. I can check and let you know because. Uh, yeah, it's too be please. Yeah, it will be okay. difficult if you. I mean, then it will spoil the whole show of the paint all bleeds absolutely, out. Absolutely, absolutely right. Okay, let me let me get back to you on that. No worries. Thank you, Francis. Uh, no, no worries, but I. I would not recommend you try it at the moment. <laughs> no, I'm not trying. I spent too much time on it. <laughs> I know, I know. Yeah, you don't want to spoil your hard work. Okay, yeah. Lorraine. 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 Mary, Mary, right? Yeah. I have done. Who's uh, Mary? Is Bo that you? Yes. No, this is. Uh, Belinda wants to. Uh, who's this? Wow, Mary. Larry. Yeah, that's a nice. Uh, that's a nice tissue. That's a nice tissue. Again, there are some creases which you could iron out by using this. Creases. Yeah, yeah. That uh, you can iron out by using the spray bottle or water. Okay. Just, just spray it. Let it dry up a bit for some time. After just spray it a bit, the the automatic those screws. But there are a bit. I mean, was the glue too watery? Uh, I don't know. I think the way I was sticking it wasn't. Uh, this is whole one paper. Or use patches of paper. Ah. Uh. Patches of paper. Oh, but that's yeah, because it should not. This is a bit extra creases are here on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This so you need to just iron thing. them out a bit. Yeah, yeah. But otherwise, oh. the the tissue paper is fantastic. Nice, nice color. Now, what you could do? Thank you. Sorry. What you could do also? You could. Uh, I mean, I'm not uh, saying you have to do it. Just suggestions and recommendations. You can use your own creativity. You can use a bit of uh, glitter on these bot. This type of red. You can use a bit of glitter. Okay. So when you're putting the glue on the edges, at that yeah. same time, you can just sprinkle some glitter to give the edges a bit of a glare shine. But once again, oh. this is this is your call. I'm not telling you to do it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, Francis, I'm done. Yeah. Where are you? Uh, yeah, Belinda. Yeah. Could you, uh, Lauren, could you spotlight Belinda? Oh, that's lovely. That's a Christmas effect. Yay. Again, we're yeah, at Christmas. Happy wow. And, um, Why is it getting a blurred effect? Oh. I'm sorry, I'm getting a blurred. The background, the, oh, no, background no, I'm blurred the background, Francis. Oh, is it? Because even the, even the, this is getting blurred. Uh, the bottle, you'll have to the keep it in front of your face, Buggy. Ah, Don't move okay. it, just keep it. Why yeah. is it something so blurred? Ah, okay. Yeah, yeah. No, no, you can't make out much. No, no, no. Lovely. Yeah, that's okay. That's yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah. that's the nice. That's had nice. a bell shape, so I said I'll make it for Christmas. The Christmas that's fine, yeah. effect. <laughs> correct, correct. So what? Uh, if you're hanging the bottle, yeah, you could uh, you could uh, stick a bit of bells underneath it. I'm not bells. Uh, those uh, balls that come no with the, under the bell. Those what do you call them? The bobbles. The no, no. These uh, uh, what do you get? The, the bells. Yeah, the, yeah, yeah, the bells. Yeah, yeah. The bells. Yeah. <laughs> The bells and it has that it has that uh, bell shape. I mean, once again, yeah, these are all suggestions. 
Also, what you could do is to cover up the neck. Yeah. Mm. Is to wrap wrap around uh, such uh, glitter. I mean, is uh, tinsel, especially for Christmas time. Sure. Mm. Ah, nice. Uh, wrap yes. around tinsel. Yes. If 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 your if your it's not Christmas and you're just doing a sort of a, a a retro effect or something, you can wrap even rope. Even rope looks absolutely brilliant when you have that. Uh, <laughs> This when you wrap around the neck. There are, there are, yeah, there are many such things you could do. There, there was one I saw which he has cut uh, small bamboo sticks, and he has placed them and stuck them, glued each stick. It look, it really looked good on a long neck bottle. So there are many, many options you can use for the neck, especially because normally what happens is people tend to uh, concentrate on the on the bottle, uh, uh, the the big part of the bottle. You don't concentrate on the neck. So the neck also gives a good effect. You could also, for Christmas, for example, you could put leaves, uh, paper leaves, uh, dropping down. You have these uh, uh, leaves which uh, which they use for no. What they use for that leaf flower making? You know, you know what the leaves it? they use for flower Pipe making. Pipe cleaners. Pipe yeah, cleaners. I don't, I don't know Pipe what they call. Pipe cleaners. <laughs> so those uh, you could you know droop uh, down like how the money plant hangs down. You could droop them down. The real, not real leaves, but the not 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 glued onto the bottle. So there are many options. Holly, I mean, holly ones. Yeah, the holly no. ones. Yeah. So those are the this for Christmas. But you can okay, you can once again. Anyone else is ready? Yeah. Anyone else that would like to show? I just put Holly a little one? glitter. I just put a little glitter on my candle. Oh. Yeah. Lauren. Sure. Wow. Oh, wow. See the yeah, that's nice now. See wow. that. Very pretty. But it's yes, drying up. It will it'll take a longer time. Glitter, you can just put some glitter, you know, on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's shining. I don't, I can't see it on the camera. But yeah, we can't see on the camera. But the uh, design is very pretty. Sabrina, is this a single sticker or pieces of stickers that okay, you put? Okay, uh, Yvette, you can show English, the bottle to your left. Single and pieces. Yeah, Whenever yes. it didn't reach, I put okay, pieces. Okay, Francis, you have a good <laughs> student. Oh, okay. This is pretty. Nice. This is also very nice. These flowers look brilliant. Beautiful. Yeah. Very beautiful, huh? Yvette, this is beautiful, yeah. Yeah, but I find awesome. the paint has to be redone. The the paint mm -hmm. is all. I think the was the paint too watery. That's what I said. You remember maybe initially I said I didn't add was... water. I didn't uh, add water, but maybe it has settled too much. Uh, okay, no, no. That's why initially when I said, if you remember, yeah. I said use it in one stroke when you're going. Don't go up and down yeah. with the paintbrush. So that's what you get from up straight down. Yeah, but it, it okay. No, that's fine. That's fine. So I should have done sideways or something? You can still do it. What I would suggest now, what okay. I would suggest now, because you don't have to worry about the base. What I would suggest, as I said, take the sponge, this piece of sponge, dab it in the paint, Yeah. dab it in the paint and just uh, just apply it on the bottle like that. You can see? I think just, that is better. Yeah. Yeah. Just okay. around, around the picture, around your tissue. Mm -hmm. it, it gives a very good uh, embossed effect and it gives a very nice rough matted look. It, it oh, makes I see. Look, wow, that would look nice. Yes, yeah, yes. it does look nice. Yeah, so it, so your bottle is not spoiled. You know, you still can <laughs> work on that. Yeah, it, it 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 really looks good. That effect, I like that effect, especially some uh during Christmas when you give the embossed effect. Another idea for Christmas uh, for Berlinda, she did that Christmas thing. Berlinda, you could also you know use thermocol. Yeah, that apply glue, apply glue to your bottle wherever you want, and thermocol. You just you know scrape Snowflakes. the thermocol and you get the small. Balls of thermocol. Balls of thermocol. Just let yes. them fall on the bottle. Let them fall on the bottle. I mean, don't you don't have yeah. each and every one. Just let them fall and you get that snowflake effect. effect. Frosty effect. Frosty. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So if you yeah, have small piece idea. of thermocol, yeah, if you have small piece of thermocol lying around the house, mm -hmm. just rub it and get all the small balls and just let it. Small let balls. It, yeah, yeah. Let it just fall on them. Uh, for uh, uh, Sabrina, another idea mm -hmm. which I had. Use because of your you were talking about the tinsel. This was the amban I made for Halloween. Wow! Oh my gosh! Wow! Beautiful! I don't know. Got put a light. Oh my wow. gosh! Beautiful! So this one, if you can see the uh, Sabrina, you can see these silver. Yeah, yeah. What I did was I took a toothpick, a toothpick. Okay. <laughs> Uh, uh, toothpick, I put fevicol or glue water and put it on wherever I want on the lines and then sprinkled uh, uh, tinsel. Tinsel, uh, this, yeah, tinsel on it. Very nice. 
Beautiful. So have you cut out certain parts for the window? Yes, perhaps? yes, yes. For the like, the windows and all for the, this to come through. Yeah. Nice. Good so Halloween. Very yeah, pretty. this is the Halloween one I've done. Yeah. Very attractive. Mm -hmm. I think we'll spend a little time with these now today. Francis, tomorrow, you can and come in the new up. year with these ideas. <laughs> we invite you for the new year. Okay? Spooky effect. <laughs> for the spooky yeah. effect. For the new year. Spooky effect. We, we book you in advance. <laughs> that will be first of all. Diwali is there before. You know, in October. October, you have to have Diwali. There are no yeah. slots available right now. So that is why I've asked him for January. January. So, so now we have an I'll idea. I'm in touch with you. Yeah, no worries. Another thing I've, I mean, what was your box? Yes, attachment. Yeah, Lorraine, can you please show Yvette, me? Why this, don't you please? put some leaves? Francis, yes. I don't know whether you saw this bottle. Oh, this is lovely. Yeah, I remember, yeah, I remember this bell. Yeah, I remember, yeah, this I remember the bell. Brilliant. Secretary is here. Oh. Hi, Hi Secretary. Hi. Oh, Hi. Oh, Hi. 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 Join the workshop. Hi. She's, uh, Manuela, as Sabrina knows, she's heavy into macrame. So that's why I said a house is a house is a total mess. Oh, nice. <laughs> but she's not showing us any. Manuela, you didn't see. You didn't see a macrame? I'll show you one. No, oh, sure, sure. Oh, oh you know, so pretty. You never showed. Why are you not putting it up, Manuela? It's like a shirt, a skirt. Beautiful. <laughs> so lovely. Very nice. Yeah, I know those, those Hawaiian lays. Hawaiian. Ah, tassels. Very <laughs> nice. Tassels, yeah. Very nice. nice. Another thing I'm dabbling into nowadays is resin. Have you all tried resin? I mean... Oh, yes. yes. My doctor I just doctor. messaged you, in fact, about it. I have two bottles that are hatching oh. in. Wow. That's, <laughs> Francis, that's book resin. for the new year. Wow. Francis, you book for the new year. Book for the new year. Resin. <laughs> Excellent. There's, there's nice, resin nice ideas. Resin. All resin. Wow. Wow. Manuela? Manuela is lucky. <laughs> Where do you get the resins? Where do you get the resins? Resin is easily available. It's available at uh, uh, that's resin. Itsy bitsy right now. Itsy bitsy. This is easily, easily available too. everywhere. And you get these this, and once again, this is not uh, rocket science. This is uh, it's very simple. It's easy to do. Wow, pretty. So, yeah. <laughs> so that's why I said jack of all. Really? <laughs> Soon Hi, you'll Lina. be the master of all. Hi, Francis. Hi, Lena. I can hear Uncle saying sure. something. Sure. I said not jack of all trades, Francis of all trades. <laughs> yes. So, you know. Joe and Lena? Okay. No, yeah. we, we didn't have the internet. It just come on. I missed oh, out everything. No worries, no worries. You'll get the recording. Oh, I think okay. Sabrina or Lorraine is doing the recording. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. okay, thanks okay. a lot. Thanks. Yeah. Hi, Joe, hi, Lena. I hope you're I coming. sent you the link, but it's, <laughs> it was a this bit is, later. This is what we learned today so far. Oh, wow. Wow, it's yeah. Beautiful. This is just a start. You can, and you need to improve on it. I mean, you need to... Francis, show us all the other things that you did in uh, decoupage. I don't have them. I've given them away. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. Because there's no point keeping them because I mean, ah. occupy space in the house. And then uh, I don't know the photograph was there, but uh, one more. But this was also a Christmas one. This is an old bottle, which I mean, I mean, oh, not. Yes. Pretty. Like norms. The norms. Yeah. Years ago, but this I did for my, my sister who's in Canada. And this is with the names. I printed their names and I stuck them. But now the the since the, the this is peeling off, you know, it's I don't know if you can see it. Uh, we can see nice. Yeah, Chris, Christine. Chris, Christina. So all those I mean this is done about five, six years ago, I think. Oh. Very this, nice. uh, so you this, wrote this, that on the bottle? No, no, no. I this I printed on uh, on sticky okay. uh, on printing those uh, transparent papers, sticky, and I printed and I pasted I stuck them on that. Okay. But that was the one which I didn't know about the varnish at that time, the lacquer. So I did not use the lacquer at that time. But I was also, I mean, I don't know whether it's a good thing or bad, but I didn't know the effect of lacquer on the matter. plastic, on the names. I mean, I could have put it on the, this because now it is, it's sort of got, lost its its glow, shine sort of. Yeah. 
Yeah. Which is better, lacquer or varnish, Francis? Both are good enough. Both are good enough. Both are good enough. You get even you get a spray. This you can. Uh, this is a spray you can use. It's a spray, so you don't have to mess. If you're not interested in messing your hands up, it's just a spray bottle. Uh, yeah, this can be used for even you can see pastel charcoal. On wood, I I I tried also <laughs> uh, to make a. A plaques, you know, wood plaques, you stick a photograph on it and then you apply this lacquer and then that photograph oh. gets uh, embed I mean, embedded. stuck on the wood. Yeah, embedded on the wood. I tried that. I was not very successful, so I gave up. Just... So how, yeah, any questions? So far, any questions, anybody? Uh, do we have to put your varnish on top of this? Uh, preferable. If you want to protect your, if you want to protect your work, it's preferable, but you have to wait for it to dry up first completely. Okay. Wait for it to dry up completely. Wait a day, two days, whatever is your this. Uh, then put apply a light coat of varnish to it. It gives a nice glow to it. But just remember mm -hmm. when you're putting it, let if you're putting tinsel or any uh, any other thing like buttons or whatever, wait for it to completely dry up before putting the this. Otherwise, all starts slipping off because that uh, mm -hmm. varnish will have some sort of effect on the glue. So first, wait for it to completely dry up and then use the varnish. And how do you uh, clean your brush after using varnish? Water. Water. I, I mean, I I use a spray nowadays. That's what it helps. With a spray, okay. it, uh, it's it's you don't need to use a brush. But uh, I'm not sure if we'll get it. I'm not sure. You should get it. Adley, show him what what uh, show Francis what you got. She's got three different kinds of uh, solutions that she bought. And okay. you got a uh, whole kit of... We can't see it. We can't see it. I can only see the caps. See this? Could you lift them up a bit? Could you lift, lift, them, lift it up. Lift yeah, them up. Yeah. Can't see Adeline. Lift, yes. Ah, okay. Yeah, these are fine. These are fine. Loss and mat. Loss and mat. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So these give two different effects. The mat, Obviously, the mat and the gloss. Mm. These are also fine. Perfectly fine. So which one would be better? It, it depends on what effect you want. If you want a shiny gloss effect, then obviously use a gloss. If you want, sometimes, as if you're using the the dabbing uh, option to get that okay. embossed effect, then you'd want a matty, matty finish. Okay. You know, we're getting a rough embossed effect of the, with the, and there are two sides. If you want a thicker, if you want a thicker em, uh, embossed effect, then you use the green portion. If you want a smaller, this, then use the yellow portion. That yeah. is a smaller. Oh. You know, you you see now when you push it against the paint and it, it gives a small a lot of yeah dots pop, pop marks like yeah yeah so it gives a nice smudges, smudges. smudges yeah. so you can use this for thicker smudges and uh, this for the thinner ones so if you're using this then you prefer to use the matte one if you're okay. just using normal normal okay. bottles you can use the glossy effect glossy one okay. but once again always remember let the bottle dry up completely it's very important to let the bottle dry up completely if all yeah. your whatever you glued onto it. Whatever, just dry it up completely. Okay. Before using the varnish. Yes, yes. Anybody else? Any questions? Or anybody wants to show the bottles? Um, uh, Marcia is doing well. Marcia, would busy. you like to show the bottle? <laughs> yeah, that's nice. Uh, could you just lift it up a bit? So you've not used a white base, as you said. But no. that's still fine. Yeah, that's still fine. That's still fine, yeah. So what you could do now when you uh, when you get if and when you get white paint, apply white paint on top, and then you can use a bit of red dab. In the same white paint, mix a little red red little uh, dry, not much of red paint. Then mix it up, and then don't you need to mix it up. What happens when you don't mix it up is you get a is you get a red and white effect, a, a smudged effect. If you mix it up, you'll get one shade all over. So you mix a little red in the white paint. And where the right uh, the red is is blending into the white, you dab into that portion, and this is so you get a nice red and white effect. So it balances mm -hmm. out your your design. I don't know if you understood what I said. I mean, was that clear enough? Yes, yes, yes. yes. Ah, yes. it's clear. So you get a red and white. You know where the red mixes with the white, it blends into the white. You mm -hmm. dab your your sponge there. So you get a nice red and white effect. It's not pink effect. That's so, Francis, bottle. what you're talking about is the neck of the bottle now. Uh, around, no, as Marcia had, edges. she's not put a white, yeah, the edges, because she's not put a white blend 
yeah. uh, white background. Yeah. So now to, you will see the edges of the bottle then, you know, if you don't put a white background, you will see the edges of the bottle. Now okay. Her, her bottle has, I mean, her tissue has red, it's basically red. So to blend it with the bottle, you could first paint the other part white. Yes. As we normally paint it, just the background. Yeah. And then okay. do the red dabbing around the edges of the tissue. Okay. okay. And that's why I said red and white. So it, it blends with the bottle and with the tissue around. Okay. 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 Thanks. Yeah. Francis, I have learned something today. See, you're what saying you expert, but I learned that you have to have white as the background. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's very even important. Even when I did the uh, morph, it doesn't have that effect. Same effect, exactly. Of, no, not the same. So we have to have the white background. Yes, yes, you have to have the white. And that's why initially I said that first, Sonia. I yeah. mean, you have to white, but True. just for because it's, uh, many people didn't have the white paint at the moment. So I said we can just still try it for, <laughs> for you all to understand the, the difference Correct. in the effect. Correct. It's very, I mean, it's important. I mean, yeah. Any other questions, anybody? So what no, I, I would like, I mean, I know your bottles are half completed, but what I would like to see is how do you all complete it? Because no point in me telling you, put this this way, put this this way. We have, we have to see your creativity, your side, your side of the story. So let's see what you all use. Use I would, I would love to see people using not bought items, but scrap items from home. Any scrap items you can cut newspaper and use. You can, I mean, there are the the the, the variety. The, the the as my wife says, the kachra in the house is endless. So. <laughs> So, so use whatever you have at home. I mean, there are some things which you would not understand the worth of. Not the worth, but how we could use it. Like toothpicks. Toothpicks are a good uh, way of using. You can just paint them green and use them as stems or whatever. There's so much, so much uh, garbage lying around the house. Like I said, this thing was was on a Christmas tree. Uh, not garbage. My wife is shouting, no garbage lying down the house. <laughs> 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 so there's, there's also this felt this I mean you normally after making a, something Christmassy you just throw out this scrap of piece of felt but I keep it and I use it and talking about felt I had made one bottle but I don't think I have it now around the place which I use the felt I can show you a photograph of it later on uh, uh, it was a red bottle with a felt I made a you know the felt waistcoat you have those just mm. a waistcoat and put a bow and these uh, gold buttons down the center. Oh, yeah. It really looked, I mean, not uh, no, <laughs> not to boast, but it really looked uh, uh, regal. You know, sort, of, sort of, yeah. Just to play, nothing else. No other no, no other effects on it. But I think I... Uh, so, I Francis, maybe in the new year you take a whole month. For what? And we we'll have these. <laughs> Our new teacher, making teacher. <laughs> so the spooky effect and then we have raisin with you raisin, raisin I'm, I'm learning at the moment doesn't matter oh, you learn no, I'm giving you 4 months so January we are booking you Jan Fab. first I think I, I, we should have a karaoke uh, session yeah, Francis. with Francis he is ace at it ace and when he was in Portugal he really swung across with <laughs> Everyone and all here listening to his beautiful voice. Oh, that was just <laughs> that was that that was the drinks doing the talk singing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what it was, but all the ladies were wanting to come and hug him because he was singing so well. <laughs> That's why I learned karaoke. <laughs> no, kidding. No, no, karaoke is also another passion of mine. I mean, it's it's fun. It's fun. Basically, I I like doing fun things. I mean, whatever makes. Uh, Again, whatever rocks your boat, you do it. I don't know. I, uh, it. Uh, some people say reading helps. I, I used to read a lot. Initially, I was a voracious reader. But now I've lost that after the, the advent of mobiles and uh, computers. I lost that habit. In Bombay, we used to read a lot. I, I got that from my dad. But uh, now we have stopped. I mean, newspaper was my, was my go-to reading. Every morning, I could not leave the house without reading the newspaper. Or take it in the train when we were walking in Bombay. But it was like my staple diet. I couldn't do without the newspaper. But now we've lost that habit. Now everybody's reading the news on the either on the mobile or your laptop, which you still don't get that, uh, you know, that uh, satisfaction of reading. That reading when you want, you want to hold that big 
three yeah. foot newspaper news <laughs> and then read it it makes it so much more interesting i don't know so those were all my habits before but now you know after technology has come in learning new arts new crafts which are pretty uh, which is pretty helpful you know in ways that we could not imagine 15 20 years ago yeah so anybody else i'm only doing the talking Francis, they like you so much. You won't believe it's almost going to be seven thirty, and no one has left the screen. It's still twenty six participants hearing your oh, that's, stories. That's that's great. That's great. But see how much they like you, and yet so, you say you're not a good teacher. I I I probably talk more than I teach. <laughs> that's required. One more question. I have one question. Yes, please. Can I Uh, sure, sure. So, uh, I, I, um, who's, who's asking you, Vet? No leech here. Yeah. Okay, if I stick the tissue on the bottle, yes, and I want to give this tissue a different effect, can I put out another tissue over it like that? Something uh, could, over the could. tissue. Yeah, you could as long as you're not spoiling the effect of the the previous tissue. You can. Uh, previous. Add, uh, yeah, you could. You could. You could. But once I again, could not just yeah. But then, once again, when you're sticking it on top of the previous tissue, just ensure that the previous tissue tissue dried up. Okay. Because you'll be applying you'll be applying glue again. So yeah, when you yeah. apply glue to tissue, if you notice, because <laughs> once again you're you're removing the two plies okay. out or the one ply yeah, out, so that tissue is really thin. Yeah. So you apply glue to a wet tissue already; it'll start uh, sort of uh, yeah spreading out. So wait for This... the first tissue to dry, then you can okay. use a second tissue. But as long as you're not covering the But once again, don't use sharp edges. Cut out the with your hands. Literally, cut out the tissue. You know, tear out the tissue to get that. Yeah. Rough effect. Yeah. But that'll be as I said. You can Thanks. you can go to town on this thing. You can do anything you want. There's no hard and fast rules to anything. Yeah. And I don't like hard and fast rules. I like to play around with whatever I get. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thanks everybody for so attending. Lord, Lorraine and Sabrina, could we have session. could we have a session where we can see the finished products? Yeah, just to see, no, no, no work as such, but just to see the finished products. Yes, Francis, we have it on Monday usually. On Monday, uh, the Magic Monday session, uh -huh. they usually show the finished products. Ah, okay, that's fine. Or I we can just... post it on the group since you don't may not. Uh, no, I could attend. attend. Uh, just tell me which Monday is that. This coming Monday. Coming Monday. Next Monday. Next Monday. Next Monday. Next Monday. Are you having Monday? Sixteenth. Sixteenth. Yeah. No, nothing. So yeah, okay. should be good. Should be good. Should be good. But if is that enough time for you all to complete it? No, one more. Monday after next. One. It's up to everybody. I don't know. It's up to everybody. I'm free next next Monday, so it's okay. Yeah. Twenty third. Monday after next year, twenty third should be. And once again, there's no there's no judgment being passed. I'm not. We are not going to select who's the best, who's the worst. No, no. This is just we just want to see no. the product. We just want to see your creativity. We don't want to judge anybody because even I'm I'm not perfect at this. I'm I'm in learning stages. So we are not, we are not going to judge anybody. So don't feel uh, embarrassed to show your product. It's fine. Everything is fine. Good and bad. We are not going to judge anybody at all. <laughs> nice. Yep. So, are we going to twenty third then? Yeah, twenty no. third. Okay. Okay, that's fine. And I'll see you, Sabrina's candle as well. <laughs> A candle. It's twenty second. Monday is twenty second. I don't know. I'm not seeing the dates. No, no, no. Twenty third. No. If sixteen, then probably twenty third. Sixteen on Monday. Twenty third. It's a September calendar. Fifteenth Sunday, twenty second. Sunday is twenty second. Twenty second is Sunday. No, Sunday would not be. Monday is a better day. Monday yeah. is our no, day. Monday. We normally have display of all creativity, creativity display. Very good. Very On good. Mondays. Yeah. Yeah. That's Monday. cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah. So we'll see everybody's uh, display. Hopefully, all those who participated. So it gives you all a chance for those who didn't bring their material to. <laughs>